In this video, we are looking at ultraviolet waves, X-rays and gamma rays. These sit at the far end of the electromagnetic spectrum with the highest frequencies and the shortest wavelengths. Let's start by looking at UV. UV waves are not visible to the human eye, but fluorescent materials absorb UV and then re-emit visible light. This means that they are often used as invisible security markers. UV waves have a shorter wavelength than visible light and therefore carry more energy. This makes them more harmful to human eyes. They are also harmful to our skin, resulting in sunburn, skin cancer and premature aging. Now let's move on to X-rays. X-rays are produced when electrons moving at high speeds are stopped. They carry even more energy than UV waves and they can pass straight through most materials that will be stopped by a thick lead plate. Because dense materials absorb X-rays, they are used for creating images of broken bones and detecting internal cracks in metal objects. Ok, gamma rays. These are made differently to X-rays. They are produced by radioactive material when unstable nuclei release energy. They have an even shorter wavelength than X-rays and therefore carry even more energy, making them penetrate substances further. X-rays and gamma rays are ionising. This means when they pass through substances, they knock electrons off the atoms and the atoms become charged. If this happens to a living cell, it can cause gene mutation or cancerous growth. Because of this, gamma rays are used for killing harmful bacteria in food, the sterilisation of surgical instruments and destroying cancer cells in radiotherapy. Anyone who works with ionising radiation must wear a blue film badge. This will change colour if they are exposed to too much ionising radiation. Ok, time for a quiz. So why do fluorescent objects glow under a UV lamp? How do UV waves compare to visible light? Give three other risks associated with UV waves. How are X-rays produced? Give two uses of X-rays. How are gamma rays produced? Give three uses of gamma radiation. What is ionization? Which wave, UV, X-rays or gamma rays has the lowest frequency?